I will tell you two jokes. So I have one hand inside the fridge, on other hand inside a stove. On an average, I am okay. This is what an average can cost you. Just one statement. The second statement is, on an average in India, or or let me put it this way: 95% of Indians are above average when it comes to having two eyes. The statement doesn't make any difference. We always have two eyes, and we all. This is what an average can actually lead you to. So when you take an average, average can be pretty misleading. For example, when you look at when you looked at the consumer price index that the government of India has published. I don't have a slide of it, but I can show it to you. Or you can you can Google it later. Look at the statewide consumer per CPI. Southern states had less than 4%. Somewhere in the middle, Mumbai had a very high CPI. And then some of the northern states had. So as a country, as a whole, we have had CPI. So how will you actually approach it? For the first time, it threw up this kind of number. Otherwise, generally, the numbers are kind of around this. So this is kind of defined. I mean, those of you who know statistics will know something called median and standard deviation, right? Median is what is the midline number. Standard deviation see, उसमें से कितना difference नीचे है. So you have to keep your median, have an approach towards median and keep an approach to standard deviation very low. If your standard deviation will be very high, then that means that you got too many things. You got a fridge and you got a cold, uh, you know, uh, 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 oven in your Universe, you will have to segregate. Fridge ko alag rakna padega, isko alag rakke, we will have to look at it. So it is called heterogeneous, creating too many, two, three groups. Isolate your extremes, which are bringing down the the averages. Like for example, in even within the CPI uh, uh, basket, we have seen. If you just look at food, for example, uh, it is quite possible that olive is very costly, and tomato is very cheap. So these are two extremes, right? Then we we'll have to, ex you know, we can't take. Then in, if it, we want to take an average, take an average, but exclude alu and exclude tomato. Budget alu separately, tomato separately, and rest of them as average. Otherwise, what will happen is your budget will be an average budget. I am sure you don't want your budget to be an average budget, right? This is a mistake that everybody does. That we are, we feel, you know, we want to have a quickly an outcome as a result of which we just pick up an average, and we don't question the average. The average is. Will always have statistically it is proven that all averages will deceptively will have extremes in it. वो extreme को अलग करना पड़ेगा. So you have to look at the composition of the average. तो उसमें से जो extreme है उसको निकाल के maybe you have to put them. You know instead of just having average मतलब एक ही bucket हो गया. मैं क्या बोल रहा हूँ उसमें तीन bucket हो सकता है पांच bucket हो सकता है उसको आपको अलग करना पड़ेगा. You have to look at what is the constitution of the bucket. जो बकेट से जो एवरेज निकल के आ रहा है उसको जरा देखना पड़ेगा बिकॉज अदरवाइज यूर बजट प्लानिंग विल गो फॉर कंप्लीटली डिफरेंट आउटकम इट विल प्रोवाइड एनी वेयर एनी वेयर वेर एवर यू आर यूजिंग एन एवरेज बी केयरफुल अबाउट यूजिंग एन एवरेज दट्स द सेकेंड पॉइंट दट आई एम से दिस आर ऑल द प्लेस वेयर पीपल मेक अ मिस्टेक आई एम जस्ट गिविंग यू When you do the retail pricing for the products, many of the businesses they include the transportation cost within the price only. Yeah. And then many businesses don't keep the retail price separately. That uh, what is my actual cost of material? What am I putting for as a commission or what is the transportation cost? You average it out, and eventually you are more or less with the price differential of one or two rupees. You sell somebody to Ahmedabad and somebody to Ahmed, uh, let's say Rajasthan and further. So that is where you may mostly averaging out. But if you go and do the naked pricing of the product, you might realize that you're losing and more transportation cost is making more difference than the. Others. I mean, some businesses do. They 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 sell with the transportation cost included. But while working out the price, also they don't work out that way. So it depends on business. This is one example where averages can fail. Salary increment seven percent is one another averages that can go beyond wrong. And sometimes we want to do it quick decisions. Faster budgets, then we end up also doing budgeting. So budget has to be given a different time. I mean, if time permits, we will be going through steps also. Yeah, then yeah. Those are where averages can. It won't fail you because it will average, but there was a chance to improve it. See, even the best going companies, markets are not growing. You can only improve internally. Beyond the point, it is all about internal. Growth. It is about internal improvement, right? Markets cannot grow ad infinitum. 
customers cannot give you keep on giving you price increase so beyond the point what what are you supposed to do you have to look at invert right you have to look at how am i going to improve my efficiency right so that's the very very important point to do that you have to you know i'm just saying aapka budget ke andar ye sab these are all things which are hiding wo andar baitha hai aapko don't ke nikalna padega so that's why i said inflation is hiding you know if in this room you know uh, we do not have full understanding of inflation then how are we going to do that so that was the first thing that was hiding i put it on the table now average is the second thing that i put it on the table there is a third thing i want to talk about but i will skip that for the time being pareto because it will go into a bit little bit of philosophical discussion but i do want to make another point i want to say is about when you are making a business plan we have seen you know hitesh has cautioned me saying that sir ye batao people only ask me most of the time to make only the revenue plan they don't ask me for the whole plan but so first of all we told you to make the whole plan but the whole plan also stops at ebitda level ebitda ke niche hum log plan nahi karte hain to kyun the biggest things are sitting below ebitda only your i is sitting below ebitda your t is sitting below ebitda your d is sitting below ebitda so interest you know in my experience i have generally seen my entrepreneur se baat kar raha hu bolega sir srini mujhe लग रहा है यार मैं मेरा एम्प्लॉज और मैं बैंकर के लिए काम कर रहा हूँ रेजनेट सुथी और नॉट मेनी टाइम यू विल थिंक दैट व्हाट आई एम डूइंग इट फॉर माय सेल्फ सो यूर आई व्हिच इज यूर बैंकर यूर इंटरेस्ट इज सिटिंग बिलो सो यू हैव टू प्लान फॉर द आई एंड इफ यूर इफ यूर आई फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू नो यू कैन से वॉक एन ए प्लान फॉर आई इट इज नॉट इन माई हैंड आर बी hello if rbi increases are pura you know you still have to get your roi you know you let do something else dusra koi adjustment karna padega if something is happening so why R, why rbi is increasing interest rates because it is expecting you to act you cannot say i will not act if i has increased is not under my control so don't do that you have to plan for i if for example your interest cost has gone up as a result of which your return on equity is going down you will have to find extra dollars somewhere either you cut expenditure or you will have to cut income sorry you will have to increase income kuch na kuch karna padega in some cases cutting income also increase profitability but that possible yes. yeah or you determine saying that i will go and take lesser limits and i will work one other thing i have seen repeatedly i have seen aapka working capital limit 2 crore hai maan lijiye example 365 days aap usko plot karke dekho 365 सिक्सटी बेटे वो दो करोड़ के ऊपर ही बैठा है दो करोड़ के आसपास ही बैठा है क्यों एक दिन तो नीचे आओ आता ही नहीं है आपका अकाउंटेंट क्या बोलता है लिमिट है लिमिट है सर लिमिट इज नॉट फॉर यूटिलाइजेशन लिमिट इज देयर फॉर इट इज सेफ्टी तो वी आर ऑलवेज यूटिलाइजिंग यू यू आस्क यूर 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 अकाउंटेंट वेन ही इज डूइंग इवन इज है बस आई को हम लोग बजट करेंगे वो बोलेगा आई को कैसे बजट करेगा इतना लिमिट है मल्टीप्लाइड बाई दिस मल्टीप्लाइड बाई थ्री सिक्सटी डेज क्यों भाई उसको कम करो मेरा वर्किंग कैपिटल को करा दो यू नो देर आर सो मेनी थिंग्स सो यू विल हैव टू एक्चुअली यू नो यू ऑल बजट यू राइट इन यूर इनवाइस रिलीजियसली इनवाइस इज पेबल एट थर्टी डेज टाइम उसके हिसाब से आपका बजट प्लान भी बना के जाता है थर्टी डेज में कौन देता है पैसा आपका कोई नहीं देता है सो द यू नो वील टू आस्क हिम वील टू हैव ए मैकेनिज्म टू आस्क द मनी इन थर्टी डेज इफ यू आर प्लानिंग फॉर थर्टी डेज रिसीट you better put a mechanism to ensure that money comes in the days that's all i'm saying don't just put 30 days in the business planning aap kuch karte nahi hai to paisa nahi aayega na paisa aapko 60 days mein aayega 60 days mein dal ke aap dekho fir aapka kitna interest cost lagta hai so i has to be budgeted in fact i can tell you another thing you know this is an exercise we did for our own self which we did the icici bank uh, census interest income calculation every month so nobody has understood uska algorithm kya hai pata nahi theek hai we actually created recreated a excel sheet key in all your month day day end balances and see whether the number comes to that particular interest so somehow we created an excel sheet which gets about 95% right number towards icici banks monthly calculated interest number do we calculate that and do we validate it and i will tell you i'm not you know i work for icic bank i'm not verifying them any banker you just calculate it at least two times or three times in a year there will be excess amount that is charged when you ask them sir galti se mistake ho gaya reverse karega with a smile <laughs> <laughs> ho gaya ki nahi 
¿Estás bol rey? No, I, I, I run a program. Oh, you run a program? Mm -hmm. Insurance for banks and insurance. Yeah. I grew is my biggest customer. Oh, chao, okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So he is running revenue insurance. So same way, you will you calculate this. So I has in unless you budget I, how will you validate your actual? So I has to be budgeted. It's a very serious thing, but people don't. If it damn it, ban kar dete hain. Then tax. Tax can be a budget. Tax has to be budgeted. Then only you will start thinking about tax planning. क्या कर सकता हूँ इतना tax है tax tax percentage है तीस टका देने का है देने का है क्या सरकार खुद बोल रहा है सर ये ये आप करो कम tax भरो तो वो करने के लिए कोशिश करना है सोचना पड़ेगा तो before the year in fact I I know of one client who calls me she need let us work on tax planning he is probably one of the hundred he says that I want to plan my tax and we have planned him and we have you know I I will not say at least once we have given him some idea how to reduce tax. That's, that's very different from what other advisors say, hey, that tax for the No one tells you that you can... Okay. Okay. Tax, 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 tax plan. 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 Planning. planning. What, what are the elements which will help you to reduce tax? No, but at least yes. all that I am saying is that you need to know, right, how much tax that you are going to do, you plan for it and then, you know, it's not that on 15 September, 15 June, 15 December, check cut kya paisa dete ho, yesa nahi hai. Wo number aapka plan ke sabse hona chahiye, nahi hai, to aapko sawal puchna chahiye. Do you have a number to verify? Is this what I have planned, right? If you don't plan your tax, then how will you plan your return on investment, return on equity, all those things, right? You are working your return on equity on PAT only, no? Profit after tax. If you don't plan for it, there are several other things that you can do to reduce taxes. There is there is a new employee-based higher uh, deduction somebody is giving, right? There is a class for that, and then there are there are there are certain investments which gives you if you are a startup you are able to claim things very differently. Um, so there are there are several things which are available, and are we using all of them? Is the best time to apply is not when you are paying tax. The best time to apply is when you are preparing business plan. That's the point that I'm. Get me. आप पहले सोच लिया इसके बारे में आपको बाद में फायदा होगा बाद में तो सोचने वाला नहीं है. You are happy cutting the check to government. You think that you are doing, you know, maybe you are paying more. And there is one more element. Honestly, I will tell you, there is this element called reconciliation. I mean, it's got nothing to do with the planning. But you know, when I talked about tax, I thought I should leave the thought also with you. That there are there are two things. One is called GST or two B reconciliation. Other one is called 26A is reconciliation. Yeah, as entrepreneurs, please ask the question to your accountant. That, jitna bhi maine GST bara hai, sabhi vendors ko, utna credit mere ko mera electronic cash register mein dikh raha hai ki nahi dikh raha hai? Nahi dikh raha hai. Every company is leaving money on the table. I am telling you. I will be. I will. I. I. I am. I am happy if I am proved wrong. I will be very happy if I am proved wrong. For a lot of the regular suppliers, you know, there is a system where you you pay GST later. You pay the main amount and yeah. GST is paid after. No, no, sure. When you get the credit. That's a good uh, system, sir. That's what we follow. Yeah, that's a good system. But do you check? जैसे आपने पेमेंट देने के बाद भी वो पेमेंट किया लास्ट मंथ बट आई एम जस्ट ऑल्सो सेट यू नो देर आर सम वेंडर्स टू होम यू मे नॉट बी एबल टू डू दिस राइट सो देर फोर आई एम सेंग द बेस्ट थिंग इज टू रेकनसाइल विद द जी एस टी आर एंड द कैश रजिस्टर टू सी दैट ये कैश हमारा कैश जो गया है वो अपने को क्रेडिट आया कि नहीं सिमिलर इज द केस ऑफ ट्वेंटी सिक्स ईयर्स आपका सौ रुपया मेरे को देना है आपको मैं आपको नाइन्टी रुपीज देता हूँ बिकॉज टेन रुपीज इज टी डी एस नाइन्टी रुपीज आपको देता हूँ टेन रुपीज ये अकाउंट में दिखाता हूँ आपका अकाउंट में क्रेडिट रिफ्लेक्ट होना चाहिए ये तीन महीने के बाद मैं करता हूँ पैसा सरकार को अभी दे देता हूँ बट लेकिन आपका रिफ्लेक्शन तीन महीने के बाद होगा बिकॉज आई फाइल अ टैक्स रिटर्न ओनली आफ्टर थ्री ईयर्स टी रिटर्न बट वो रिटर्न में आपका नाम डालने से इसका नाम डाल सकता है हो सकता है तो वेदर दिस मिस्टेक एज हैपन आर नॉट वी डोंट चेक वी चेक एट द एंड ऑफ द ईयर so 26 years and these things you know and this has got nothing to do with the business plan i'm just saying this reconciliation is cannot be left to the accountant don't just leave it to the accountant it's money on the bank at least once in a month or once in three months sit with your accountant ask him the question you know 
आस्क इम द क्वेश्चन सर ये नंबर टैली हो गया कि नहीं होगा दिखाओ मेरे को एक बार तो आप पूछ लीजिए वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सॉरी This is a topic generally they ever share. If you receive IT notices or GST notices for any reconciliation, means they knew at some point right there was differences. They just didn't share. It's not that they don't feel it important to be shared with the promoters. That is another attitude. I mean, thing that we have that promoter should be given only important items. So that is why even detailing in budget is overall because we want to discuss the granular items. Otherwise, you will only discuss what you observe by walking. And you do budgeting, and when you list down the stuff, you see everything. Otherwise, generally in the plant also people who done manufacturing. I have seen lot of promoters have observation what they they observe by doing the site visit. Whereas if everything right from wastage to this to sale to scrap sales, everything is part of your budget and then part of your MIS, then you don't have to. Nobody has to highlight it to you when to see. You see it regularly. So that is why budget detailing is required to that extent. To show that the manufacturing entity knows. So those are main other aspects. Yeah. So I I will just talk about one more aspect, and then so depending upon the sorry. Okay. So see, as a promoter or as somebody who is running the business, it's very difficult to go when you're doing so much of transactions to do it. So is there a multiple that you can look at saying that you know on a single MIS, uh, just to keep a quick track of whether those ITCs have come in or ITCs and the other taxes? No, no. So Because you can't go through so much of detail. No, That's no, why you have somebody to, to look at it. Right? Yeah. No, I am only saying you ask him the question. Which which you do? Him. But at the end of the day, it's like you, you know you look at certain numbers and then that's what triggers off a thought process. You yeah. can't just validate no, everything no, 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 that no, no, is. No, no, no. So generally, when people people make MICs, one thing is for sure they don't misrepresent. They hmm. selectively represent. <laughs> that's right. <Okay. laughs> nobody misrepresent. Nobody will give you intentionally yeah. fraud data. They might choose not to give you that data. So let's say only the last three four slides of the MICs. One is a slide on your legal notices. Most probably it will come same. It doesn't change. You don't have to do, but be let it part of it. At True. least somebody is thinking True. once a month True. that let me check the status of my legal notice. Similarly for GST, just you don't have which client has not paid. Just that January what input has not come, February what input has not come. Just so total total. You know even it is five lakh rupees. You are not. No, I will I will give you another simple thing that I do. When you pay the GST check, right? You ask him what is the amount of. Credit that is not reflected, which I am paying extra, right? Ask him two questions. So give me the amount that is not you are not claiming credit for it, and give me the breakup of this. How much is timing difference and how much is permanent difference? Mm. If it is timing difference, then you note it down. The next time when you are asking, yeah, last time timing difference, this time I want to change, come on, change. It should not be. If it is timing difference, every quarter that means it is permanent difference. Ask him that question. That's the one question that we ask. Right. Yeah. So, so yeah. Don't have to have that. What was yeah. the ten people have not? What was my hundred <coughs> GST last time? Eight lakhs. What is this time? Six lakhs. Is that improved? Okay. It has gone up. Then, then you can further ask questions. You don't have to complicate your MICs, but there has to be an indicator that this has to be. Viewed. Or more than indicator, it is an indication that somebody is viewing, even though you don't view it. Okay. But if it's an approach when finance team and the department knows that this number is going, this but we don't see all MIS reports. Equally, right? We all have our biases. Also, we like certain area more. We like, but at least when somebody is reporting, they take care of it. Because of the thing. Yeah, let it come as part of the uh, yeah, full package. So there is one last point I want to talk about planning. Is that you know those of you who are interested, please Google and figure uh, find there is a foundation in the US called Long Now Foundation. Long Now Foundation. You know what do they do? they do a very interesting thing their their topics are all very interesting they look at what will happen to humanity 300 years from now they only look at minimum 100 years 200 years 300 years they don't look at now so that's why they are long now foundation so similarly have a view on your business also long term view of your business what will happen to your business 10 years from now? i mean you don't need to 100 years 10 years 20 years 50 years have a view and just fine tune it on a year on year basis because sometimes 10 year also goes very very fast so if you have a view and by thinking long term you know one day we decided right in cfo bridge we decided that let's just think long term 